Welcome to Canvas Assignments and Assessments. In this portion, we will be discussing ungraded assignment and assessment options. Within Canvas, you have the option to create ungraded assignment and assessment options such as formal assignments, discussions, surveys, and practice quizzes. For formal assignments where you have a student uploading or attaching submissions through Canvas assignments, you have the option to make the assignment grade not count towards a final grade. For formal assignments where you have a student uploading or attaching a submission through Canvas assignments, you have the option to make the assignment grade not count toward a final grade of the course by selecting a box within the assignment options. This box can be found below display grade as. Select the check mark to not count the assignment toward a final grade. Selecting this option allows for you to create a graded assignment but does not incorporate that grade into the final course grade. This allows for you to build scaffolded assignments where the grade comes from the submission of multiple parts of the assignment. For instance, having a student submit a series of low stakes writing assignments before they submit an essay assignment. I can have an annotated bibliography, for instance, built into my rubric for the overall essay assignment and provide points for the main assignment itself. Additionally, you can create an assignment to be worth zero points. You can utilize this format to create a column within your gradebook for extra credit opportunities where not every student may need to participate. Similar to formal assignments, discussions can be ungraded as mentioned in an earlier segment of this workshop and can be utilized for check-ins, general discussions between students, or as Ask the Professor style forums where students can come and ask course-related questions and respond to one another. In order to ensure that a discussion is ungraded, simply open the discussion and when looking at options, make sure that the graded option is deselected. If you are utilizing ungraded discussions for a weekly check-in, make sure to add it to the student to-do list. That way it shows up under their to-do list to complete by that particular date. Utilizing classic quizzes, you can designate practice quizzes and ungraded surveys from the quiz type option. Within new quizzes, you have similar functionality as with formal assignments where you can mark the quiz as being worth zero points. Or you can select a checkbox to not count the quiz toward a final course grade. Utilizing classic quizzes, you can designate practice quizzes and ungraded surveys from the quiz type options. Within new quizzes, you have similar functionality as with formal assignments, where you can mark the quiz as being worth zero points, or you can select the checkbox to not count this quiz toward the final grade. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit clt.odu.edu.